Okay, folks, this props is my last outdoor shot of the evening. Uh, it's currently 5.30 on Sunday evening, September the 10th, 2017. We're dealing with Hurricane Irma. Uh, this is taken out front of the Victoria property here in Vero Beach, Victoria condominium property. And uh, this was rather an easy shot because I took it from the uh, porch and I was uh, fairly protected as we get go further you'll see more uh, here we are inside the garage looking out of the garage looking north and uh, at this particular location the wind was blowing pretty hard uh, but at least I was protected and uh, we've had some 75 mile an hour gusts up here the storm is moving north. We expect the worst of it to be sometime between 10 and midnight tonight, Sunday, uh, as it's moving up the west coast. Now, this was a really tough shot. I was outside, and uh, this is very, very difficult. The wind was blowing probably 60 to 65 miles an hour, according to my wind gauge. And as you can see, I can't stay here very long because it was really trying to blow me over, and that was the surf at uh, 5.30 this evening here at the Victoria Condominium at our beach location. Uh, so was it, that, was a, that was kind of a tough shot. Couldn't uh, do much with that. I apologize for that, but I wanted to at least get a, an idea what was going on here. And then once again, that's a shot of our building. And the next shot here is uh, from the south end of the building looking out at the pool area and uh, You'll notice down here is the light that uh, fell. I think it took a shot of that. There it is. Yeah, it's knocked over and land down there, but I did. It is protected, so it'll be all right. But I wanted to keep the lights on in the property as long as I could, as long as we have electricity. And fortunately, we still have electricity, knock on wood. We don't know for how long we're going to have it, but we do have it. So, as I say, maybe the last video this evening. Tomorrow, I'll be out and about, and we'll be able to show you exactly what's going on what's happened and what kind of shape we're in. I don't know how long it will be before I'll be able to post the video because I don't imagine that we're going to be able to keep electricity past midnight tonight. If we do, it certainly would be a miracle. This is the last shot coming up here that I took uh, in just a second we go through this transition. And this was taken from the second floor balcony looking out at the courtyard. And once again, uh, it doesn't look like it's that bad, but it was really blowing quite hard. I can't tell you what the wind speed was there because I was protected, but it's probably 45 to 50 miles an hour. So as I say, uh, we're very lucky we did dodge a big bullet. Uh, and fortunately, it's over on the west coast. Irma's on the west coast, and uh, hopefully she won't do too much damage. She is now a Category 2 over there, and uh, we are going to receive a significant amount of rain and wind over here this evening between about 8 o'clock and midnight. So uh, just uh, stay tuned and I'll get back to you and have some more videos for you. Be safe. Have fun. And I uh, hope that I will be able to give you some uh, really good videos on uh, t the town as well as our building. And hopefully we, weren't gonna ha we aren't going to have any serious issues with our building. We only have two problems so far. The lights down and we did lose the air conditioner on the second floor in the front uh, hallway. It, it didn't blow away, it's just not functioning properly. Other than that, it's the only damage I know of that we have here as a result of the hurricane. Be safe, have fun, keep watching. I guess this video never ends. Every time I look at it, it continues to go. So apologize, but there's the trees in the front of the building, and uh, we're very fortunate so far. So just keep your fingers crossed, and hopefully everything will be just fine here. Thank you for watching. One more thing I wanted to add is we've fortunately been not... Uh, had any power outages. We haven't had to use the generator. Comcast has stayed up. The power company's uh, power has been on constantly, so that's a really good thing. I don't expect it will continue much longer, but so far we've been very fortunate, and uh, just keep your fingers crossed for us. Have a great evening. Talk to you tomorrow.